week, we're in Austin, Texas. I'm Julia Gonzalez, and today we're diving into Austin's vibrant food truck scene. That's right, from pizza to tacos to briskets, Austin's food trucks have it all. Whether you're planning a trip or just craving some delicious eats, join me for this food yeah. truck adventure. So today we're here at Pita Rosso's. I'm so excited. They're known for their New York style of pizzas. They have two locations in Texas and we're here at the original trailer in Austin. And since it's our first time visiting, the friendly staff really helped us in deciding which pizza would be best for us. This is our sausage and peppers pie. It has like, it's like the fresh Mott's pizza, but sausage roasted red bell pepper. And of course a meat pie because we're in Texas. Okay. <laughs> we're gonna do the meat pie. pieces are huge and it's hot. Man, I'm going to be the one that burns my mouth. So look at that flop there. That's a flop. <laughs> mm. Oh wow. That is so good. The sausage has like a spiciness to it. Same with the pepperoni. And there's tons of spices and cheese. And look at, look at the oil there. Oh, I was so hungry and I needed this so much. Oh my God. Thank you, baby Jesus. This is exactly what I needed. So good. Because it's the meat lovers, there's like a spiciness to it with the salt and yeah, pepper. The sauce is spicy too. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, it's cheese. <laughs> okay. Oh, my God. There's a nice crispiness to the bottom too. Yeah, it's perfect. I mean, that is just brilliant. I'm gonna give it a 9.5. You give it a 9.5? For a New York yeah, wow. it's pretty good. If you didn't think I could eat it. Uh, no, I did not eat this whole thing. I did share, but I could have eaten this last piece because this was delicious. I gotta save room for other places. So we're gonna be touring around, doing more food here in Austin. But this was a great place. I'm super impressed. I mean, this amazing pizza came out of a trailer. What? Delicious, they know what they're doing and they did an exceptional job. We're here at Radio Coffee and Beer for a food truck that is only found here called Briskets. This is where you'll find two of Texas favorites, barbecue and biscuits. That's right, juicy smoked meats and delicious flaky biscuits combined to create the perfect sandwich. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We got the brisket sandwich. I think this is going to be like a Texas breakfast sandwich. You know, like, this is what you expect from Texas. This is going to be, this is going to be all over my face, you know. It. But it looks delicious. Oh, the smokiness of the meat with the sweetness of the jelly. Oh my god. That brisket, or the, the biscuit. It's delicious. It's buttery. The biscuit is so buttery. I might have a heart attack right here, but this is worth it. <laughs> you see this like little bit of fattiness too in the brisket? Oh my. Oh my. That's the bite. It has like the pepper, the salt, the fat. Oh. oh. Amazing. It's like every piece of like delicious taste in one. Sweet, salty, buttery. 
That was delicious. Amazing. I, <laughs> we were joking, like, but it really could be like a last meal. Like, this is what you would ask for. You got the butter on the amazing biscuit. I wanted to say brisket, but <laughs> biscuit. Have, oh, the smokiness of that brisket was like amazing. And then the, the jelly, the jam on top of it, the sweetness that comes out of that. Oh my God. You have never had a breakfast sandwich until you've had that. Sorry. You aren't living until you And then you can die back. You can die happy. <laughs> it's great. Cheers. Spicy Chicken Austin, all sources will point you to one place called Spicy Boys Chicken. They're known for their spicy Asian inspired fried chicken and wings. Since initially opening in 2019, Spicy Boys Chicken now has five locations throughout Austin and has been raved about by many, including Peter Austin, Austin Monthly, and Austin Food Magazine. I like chicken and I like spice, so that's why I'm here. So we are here at Spicy Boys Chicken. We heard best fried chicken in Austin, so I'm digging it. <laughs> That's a papaya salad. Papaya salad. Okay. Oh, oh my goodness. You can already see the spice. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Oh, you can smell it too. Look at that. It looks just like so spicy and juicy and it's hot and I'm gonna burn my mouth. <laughs> oh wow. Oh wow. Oh yeah, it's spicy. But it's so good. It's the kind of spice where you wanna just keep eating it. I can't, like, ooh, it burns, but ooh, I love it. <laughs> That's what it's like. Do you see how juicy that is? Look how juicy that is. That is juicy. It's sweet. It's spicy. Mmm. Whoa. I love that. I'm trying to place that flavor. Mmm. Now for the papaya salad. This looks super yummy. Some noodles, cilantro, bits of like nuts. Oh wow, that is really good. It's so like, it's, wow, it's so flavorful. It's cold and like the perfect offset. That really hot and spicy chicken. <laughs> it like soothes my tongue because my tongue is on fire right now. It's on fire, but this is really good. Wow, there's so many, like, it's so flavorful. Oh, hot, spicy, peppery. Mmm. I can't feel my tongue. <laughs> I can't, I can't feel it. <laughs> I mean, that food is just, everything we try is like the best. This is amazing. So that was absolutely delicious. It's more, it's not your typical fried chicken. It has an Asian flair to it, so it has the sweetness. It's super spicy. Like, my mouth is on fire. I cannot feel my tongue. I have lost all, all the fluids out of my face. <laughs> if you love spicy like that, you're gonna love Spicy Boys chicken, fried chicken. You're gonna love it. <laughs> so tonight we're at Quanto's Tacos. There's some amazing, authentic Mexican city tacos. I'm so excited. It's why I love Austin, because you can get so many amazing, delicious dishes 
I mean, I just, I love it here. And I'm so hungry, so can't wait. Let's dig in. So we got one of each. Um, there is a suadero taco, a mushroom taco, a chorizo taco, a pork taco, a pork cheeks taco, and what else am I missing? Oh, um, I said chorizo, right? Yeah, it's chorizo, pork stomach. Pork stomach. So it's dark, it's hard to see. I'm just gonna pull one out. <laughs> but they're little, like look at compare, like they're little. So two bite taco, maybe three bite. Look, look how little they are. I think that's a chorizo. Okay. Holy, holy. That is delicious. It's spicy. It's got the perfect amount of cilantro. It's got onions. Oh my gosh. It's just dripping. Mmm. It's so good. And they're really hot. Like, obviously, just made. Oh my god. Wow. Wow. That chorizo has like so much flavor and a hint of spice. So you're getting like this lots of flavor and then a little bit of heat at the end. Oh my God, that is so good. I could eat like 10 of these. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna go in for what we think is the Suadero taco here on the end. But again, you can't see, so. <laughs> is it because I'm old? No, I'm not old, come on. 50, 60. Yeah, that's good. It's really like just tender. Melts in your mouth. It's so yummy. A little bit of fattiness in there. You can taste the fattiness. Mmm. I can't get over it. And the corn tortillas are the best. I love corn tortillas. Growing up, central Pennsylvania, we always had flour tortillas, and they're just not as good. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I just got a whole bunch of fattiness at the end here. Okay, so for the guys, they can probably do two bites. Takes me three, but they're delicious. Wow, wow, wow. I love it. This is what we have to do to keep eating the way we eat. We have to go run. And here in Austin, you have these beautiful parks that you can, it's beautiful. <sighs> Menu. So tonight we're at the Churro Company. I am so excited for churros. Guys, I have a huge sweet tooth. I just can't help it, love it. Hey! They have ice cream. They have apple on top. They, it looks like there's some caramel. Oh, this is for me. <laughs> Ooh, the crunchiness, the churro. Mm. <laughs> oh my God, I have been waiting for this. This is delicious. It's sweet. It's salty. It's got this amazing caramel and apples. It's like a warm, cinnamon like what apple pie. Just delicious. And I love that they added ice cream. Mm. You do not know how much this makes me so happy. I'm so happy. <laughs> delicious. Mm. As I'm enjoying this wonderful sweet treat, I also wanted to say, because it reminded me, my little buddy, Grayson, happy, happy birthday. Happy birthday! Tell your mom you want to come here and have a sweet treat for your birthday. That was absolutely delicious. I loved every single plate. They have so many different options here. A great idea for a truck. You can come here and pick all sorts of different flavors, all sorts of different toppings, but 
it's so divine. I could, I wish I could have them all. <laughs> So baby, what happened? I wiped out on the trail. So you gotta get, get some boo-boos. <laughs> I haven't fallen running in a long time. It's just walking. You usually fall walking. <laughs> True. Okay, today we're at La Santa Barbacha and they are one of the best Mexican cuisine food trucks here in Austin. I'm so excited. They're known for their barbacoa technique of cooking the meat. Typically that's underground. They have their own style of how they do it, but I'm so excited to give it a try. So this is their quesadilla. You can see they have tons of cheese, cilantro, the barbacoa meat, onions. Let's squeeze in some lime here. Yeah. Add some sauce to this. Ah. Yeah, look <laughs> Mmm. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. That is so good. Oh my god. The meat is so tender and flavorful. And that sauce, that sauce that you put on, mmm, that is delicious. Mm. Wow. We should have got more of these. <laughs> this is so good. Oh my god. Mmm. I love it. That's delicious. Wow. What do you think? Amazing. Oh, I love that meat. So juicy, flavorful. The cheese is amazing. Wow. That was absolutely delicious. The barbacoa. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. This was delicious. Um, wow. If I lived here, I'd be here almost every day. I heard their chilaquiles is also really good. So when I come back to Austin, I'm coming here and I'm having the chilaquiles. Delicious. Uh, the, the quesadilla was also phenomenal. That's why I'm coming back. <laughs> oh, did we leave it in the car? So we're at Jubilee Sliders. I mean, come on. I love a good slider. I love a good burger. So we got the gringo. It's a regular cheeseburger. And then we got the bato. Yeah. The bato. I'd say bato, but it's bato, which has pepper jack cheese. It has jalapenos. It has some kind of like spicy chili sauce. Like a spread. Yeah, it's like a spread. So I know which one it is. I think I have to try the, the jalapenos. I mean... I gotta try it. something I've never had before. All right, so let's give it a look at it. It's so cute and looks tender and juicy. <laughs> Holy cow, that is really good. It has a lot of flavor. It's done medium, so you have a little pinkness inside. Um, but the pepper jack cheese with the jalapenos, wow, really delicious. I really like that. Awesome. I love that. So now let me try the gringo. Regular. Oh, I love all the cheese on it. it has pickles, which I love the pickles. <laughs> wow, these are delicious. Again, I could eat 10 of these. <laughs> I'm gonna gain so much weight here. <laughs> so, really great burger. I loved it. I also did not mention the potato roll. Potato roll went so well. I mean, your bite just, it just, melts in your mouth. It's delicious. It's a fun location. You can come and have a, a beer here at the little Violet Crown Social Club. <laughs> I'm driving, so no beer for me. But um, the burgers were fantastic. It's a fun little hip area. It's 
got a lot going on here, so if you want to come for the social scene, this would be a great spot. Love it. So that concludes this week's food truck tour here in Austin. Such an amazing time here. I had so much fun and we only got on the cusp of food trucks. There's so much amazing, delicious food here in Austin. So for more fun, more food, hit that subscribe button. We'll see you on the next video.